Thank you, Greg. Yes, a field of six on the trot for qualifier number four. Just the one driver change in here on number one medley sealster. Tyler Borth is now at the line. So one medley sealster is a wheeling and dealing filly. Tyler Borth will do the driving to his points in the pain. A bar hopping filly with James McDonald. Next up will be number three, Ivy Lynn. Green man, Alishi daughter, Sylvan filly on drives. Four is Amazing Grace Deo. She's a daughter of six pack. Jody Jameson between the wheels. Five is Lasting Dream. Cantab Hall filly with Chris Christofferu. And six is Teller's Choice. This is a daughter of the bank with Louis Waugh to do the driving. So a field of six for qualifier number four on this Saturday morning here from Woodbine Mohawk Park. Fourth of 14 to go forward here today. Starting eight years, the top of the stretch, a field of six. Two-year-old trotting fillies are lined up. Gate swings into the stretch, and here they come for the fourth. And they're off and trotting, and it's going to be a good beginning here for Amazing Grace Deo as that one looks to move out to the lead. At the inside is Medley Sealster. In between horses is Point in the Paint, and on the upside, that's going to be Ivy Lynn, who does come forward. So the quartet will make their way past this for the first time, and out to the lead goes Amazing Grace Deo. Making a break was Ivy Lynn. That one goes off stride, so Medley Sealster will stay there in second as Points in the Paint will trot in third as they go into the first turn. So all alone right now, this is going to be Amazing Grace Dale and Amazing Grace Dale by three and a half lengths was at the opening panel in 33 seconds flat. So it's left as a three horse race here as they'll move into the back stretch. In second, that is Medley Sealster and then tracked there by points in the paint in third. And the early breaker resetting is Ivy Lynn and she'll try to do her best to catch up to the front three as on the lead continues to be Amazing Grace Dale. She's a daughter of a six pack and she's not going to have the lead much longer here. So as things were back down in the second quarter, we get the move from Medley Sealster, who's going to loop around to try and grab command. Points in the paint still follows there in third. And then we go back to Ivy Lynn in fourth. The half was hit in 105. And as they go on to the far turn, Medley Sealster was ready to go. And the wheeling and dealing Philly moved to the lead and leads it by two and a half lengths. Back in second is Amazing Grace Dale. Third is points in the paint. Ivy Lynn is back into the mix now as that one was able to catch up after the early break. So the field of four is midway around the far turn. Medley Sealster by a pair in second is Amazing Grace Dale. Points in the paint. Right on that one's helmet in third and then in fourth is Ivy Lynn as they're by three quarters with Medley Sealster getting there in 135 and three. That was our fastest clip to this point as they went 30 and three in the third quarter and they spin off the turn and into the stretch. Medley Sealster trying to get some separation now. Leads it by a couple of lengths. Amazing Grace Dale in second. Points in the paint. Came to the outside and that one is making up some ground on the outside trying to get to the leader's wheel. Medley Sealster points in the paint on the outside into second. Amazing Grace Dale and Ivy Lynn. Medley Sealster at the edge of the tote boards. Got this one. Will win it by a little more than a length. Points in the paint was second. Amazing Grace Dale was third. And Ivy Lynn finished in fourth. The time of the mile was 2.05 and three final quarter in 30 seconds. So it was Medley Sealster going to get done here. Not content with the uh, the two-hole trip and the early pace. Uh, went to the front in the second quarter and then uh, out sprints rivals uh, with a 30-second final quarter to stop the clock in 2.05 and three points in the paint. Nice rally finish uh, almost last.